Good morning. Are you ready for a simultaneous sip? It's Sunday. Um, somehow we've opened the blinds on our windows, in the middle of our windows, so the light comes in. And that helps me wake up earlier. That's great. It actually seems more beautiful out, even though the days have been really cold <laughs> yesterday and today. So um, it was so cold we could hear our roof cracking, the wood cracks in the cold. But no matter, I still feel like it's getting lighter and lighter or I'm waking up earlier and earlier or something is different. So I guess light does that to you. The light is coming in. So hopefully the light is coming in for you too. Um, I caught up on the reading in my book and um, for January 24th, it's, uh, it says hire the stunt double. Let's talk about Matt Damon, how he um, got wise after filming his Jason Bourne series. And when he was filming one and the one in Berlin, nine years later after his first one, he realized he couldn't perform all those stunts and uh, so he hired a stunt double and so he kind of uh, realized he could use the help and that's what we're supposed to realize that uh, you can't perceive your own best interests sometimes because you're looking at the past and your brain is jumping ahead as to uh, predicting the future and your brain might not always like your kind of your ego might not know what's good for you. It wants to protect itself. So that's what it's trying to teach. And um, you got to identify with the bigger part of yourself. Um, and this voice or the source is available to each and every one of us. And it transcends ordinary experience. So that's kind of a neat uh, lesson for today to focus on. Um, and like I said, I sometimes read out of this book and focus on those messages. Sometimes I completely forget them right after this video. So hopefully you're listening now and you got something out of that. Um, and I don't always send those messages, but to me, they're kind of interesting. They give us something to think about. Um, so hopefully you are having a great weekend. You are thinking about the upcoming uh end of the month and that we've made it through January. I've been writing in my journal and I just got to the back of the book so I got to start a new one and I realized I my first entry in this particular journal was in August. So for me it's fun to read back on those things and find out how much has changed. What was I thankful for back then? Well, time does go by so I don't know. It's kind of neat to look back but um it's great to be grateful about new days each day. Okay, have a great one.